So Zoom events just announced multi-track conferences. I am blown away. Zoom has combined Zoom meetings, webinars, live streaming, event ticketing, website management. I cannot believe how easy it is to use to do a virtual summit. I've been working on it all month to set up the Stream Geek Summit, which is happening this week. And I wanna show you guys why I think this platform is a game changer. Let's check it out after this. So here's the part right here that I find most amazing. It's the multi-track kind of choose your own adventure style of virtual events that I believe is a game changer. You can have multiple sessions, whether it's a webinar um, or a meeting, and you can have them running at the same time. And I just wanted to share some of the thoughts we've had in our Stream Geeks planning meetings about how to use this. So we've got our main presentation area, which is right here. This is a webinar, okay? So you know we're not worried about the main webinar, having people unmuting and muting and all of that. It's just for the speakers and that main presentation happens throughout the conference. You might have multiple tracks of that, but we'll just have one at our summit. Then we also have like an open hangout hallway, and that's just an open meeting room. It's like our reunion for those who have come to the Stream Geek Summit in the past. Then we also have our sponsor round robin, where the sponsors are going to have an opportunity to have like a round robin and each present themselves, and then get into small breakout rooms. So the meeting rooms give us that breakout fu room functionality where we can have small groups and really get to know each other whereas these hangout hallways are just meant to be open for networking and chatting and then you've got the webinar on top of all of this each one of these all four of these tracks and sessions are live streamed to the lobby so as a participant of the virtual event you can just sit in the lobby and decide what you want to watch You've got an event chat room where you can collaborate with others. And then if you so choose, you can go into the webinar or the meeting room experience and join. And I just find that almost a, a replacement for YouTube and Facebook, but with the opportunity to get more engagement and more collaboration out of the virtual event. So for me, that's a game changer. All right, well, that's it for this video. I hope that you attend the Stream Geek Summit if you'd like to learn more about this, experience Zoom events, and see what it's all about. We're gonna be covering it post-show as well to see what worked, what didn't, what features we think Zoom should add. But honestly, this is a beautiful platform. We're so much further than we have been in the past years ago trying to mix YouTube live streaming with meetings and, and webinars, and now it's just all in one centralized place from an event manager's perspective, it just, you don't have to sweat it, right? It just makes it easier. You just know it's gonna work. Everyone's familiar with Zoom. There's a few little hiccups, such as when you invite people to Zoom, you must use their Zoom email address that they use to log in, small things like that. We're trying to help people understand the difference between a webinar and a meeting and make sure that's all upfront so there's no confusion. But I honestly think Zoom has revolutionized virtual events and I'd like for you guys to join us so you can check it out. All right, until the next video, don't forget to subscribe to see what's going to come next because this industry is always changing and it's exciting to be part of it. Talk to you guys soon. Bye.